Alton and Keen came to the club one morning with their mom, and uh, they're around the age of seven or eight. I think my brother and I were just too shy to kind of go train for the first day with them. And I mean, there were even there were classmates out there. I don't know why we were so shy, but uh, so she just suggested giving us a, giving us an old fiver for going down. That's all it takes. <laughs> It was the best five euro I think I have spent. All he ever wanted to do was play rugby then. First impressions is a, a, a bit of a, an old head and young shoulders. Um, had a pretty meteor, meteoric rise, I think, through the ranks in terms of Connacht in Ireland. So weird. <laughs> Connacht had a few injuries in the, in the row, and uh, I got selected for a couple of games. Just happened to have a, a few decent performances, and. All of a sudden, uh, Pat said that Joe was thinking of bringing me in for a training camp after Christmas, and I mean, the fear that went through me then. Yeah, he, he was raw. <laughs> he was a bit lost. Oh man, he's so quiet. Well, sorry, when he arrived, he was really quiet, but he was just a new kid on the block, I suppose. Uh, realistically, we didn't think he'd get the call for to be part of the squad. And when funny. you did then, <laughs> but when you, well, when we did, we were just delighted, we were thrilled to bits. I got a letter in the post for him, Alton Delan, uh, uh, Connacht and Ireland rugby player. <laughs> a little child's writing, it was wonderful. We're down here in a predominantly GA environment. Isn't it great that there's a local hero? Absolutely. You know, there's, a, there's an Alton Delan in, in, in Kerry, there's a Tommy O'Donnell in Tipperary, you know, there's somebody, it's, it, it's vitally important. It was a Twickingham really, it was wonderful. Um, his first cap, and we were saying, Will he get on? Will he get on? You know, and my nephews were with me, I think, yeah, was, um, uh, yeah. and they said, Oh, look, he's on the bicycle, I think he'll be on soon. Going right back to his younger days, he has that unique uh, uh, style. He drops the head and puts the hand out and just goes up the middle. And when he got that opportunity against England in Twickenham, he, uh, he smashed through a, an attempted tackle from Dylan Hartley, got him behind them, got a great offload to, uh, to Josh van der Fleer, and, and it almost built to a try. He's a talented individual. He's a big boy that can move. And if he kind of stays, stays the course and, and, and works hard and is disciplined, you know, he's got the talent. You've got to consolidate what you're already good at, but you've, you've got to challenge yourself to be as, uh, as good as you can be. Even when you look across Europe, there's, there's so many good second rows and Yo, know, for Alton Delane to get into that realm, he, he's, he's got to keep working really hard.